example one. Compute sine of x squared double prime. Okay, so if you put double prime just like that, prime prime, that means you, you not only have to find one derivative, but you have to find two derivatives. Solution. You start off by finding the first derivative. Now, because x squared is nested inside, we have to use the chain rule, which says differentiate the outside function, leave the insides inside unchanged, but pull the inside function outside and differentiate, which gives you 2x. Therefore, the first derivative is 2x times cosine x squared. Okay. Now, in order to get the second derivative, you differentiate the first derivative. Since this is, this is already differentiated once, differentiating one more time gives you the second derivative. Okay, however, this time you have a product and, and the, a nested function multiplied together, so you need to use both the product rule and the chain rule. So let's, let's do that. This is a product rule, so apply the product rule. Okay. And then 2x differentiates to 2. Cosine x differentiates to negative sine. <coughs> x squared, but again, x squared is a nested function. You pull that outside and differentiate. Derivative of the inside function is 2x. That's multiplied outside. And then let's simplify as much as possible. The way you simplify this is you have a negative 2x multiplied to 2x. What's that? That's negative 4x squared. And you have sine x sub squared. All right, so I want you to do the following example on your own. Example two, uh, find cosecant of 2x double prime. 